One hit music station 804. It is Friday. It is Free Fortune Friday. It's Neil White here. Melissa is Hello. there. Mark is over here producing our show. And of course, Espirito Gato is here. Good morning. How are you? Good morning. How are you guys doing? Welcome into the show. See, this is this is different. We're, we're like the fill-in hosts. You know what I mean? So it's like yeah. we're all getting to know each other. And of course, it is Free Fortune Friday. So we'll take your calls at 508-994-1071. We'll get as many in as we can in the next hour or so. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Um, I grew up in L.A. I've been here in the East Coast for the last five years. Okay. Um, defi definitely different environment. Um, L.A. was a crazy city, and uh, and um, I, I gotta say, when people say, "What do, what do you, what would I prefer to choose?" Right. You know, uh, I gotta say, I've gotten very adjusted to living in, in the very quiet area, so I like it yeah. a little bit better. So he's, he's liking the East Coast. Yeah, you guys, you guys uh, definitely work me in. Excellent, <laughs> excellent. So uh, we'll take your calls and. Uh, uh, a lot more. It's Neil White, Melissa's here, Mark is here, Spirit of Gato's here. It is Free Fortune Friday. So much going on. Don't forget, thousand dollars twice today could be in the cards for you, right? Nice. <laughs> <laughs> could be in the cards for you. Thousand dollars twice today. We gave you the times earlier. We do it every weekday between well, any time. Could happen at any time. So uh, be listening for that. Your shot to win a thousand dollars. All right, let's go to the phones. It is Free Fortune Friday. Good morning. Good morning. You're on with Free Fortune Friday. Say good morning to Spirit of Gato. Good, good morning. How are you? Doing great. Thank you for asking. How are you doing? I'm doing okay. <laughs> <laughs> as long as it doesn't rain, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that helps. Yeah, definitely. Um, so did you want me to um, just basically tell you uh, what I see right away, or was there anything specific? Um, general reading, um, what you see first, whatever. Okay. What I am seeing as of right now, um, the star the, the star came out for me right away, and that card came out backwards. And what I get right away from this is that as of right now, you really do need to focus on healing yourself. Okay, I don't know if you're having a medical issue right now, or maybe you're even down or, or you're depressed. But I am seeing that as of right now, you really got to focus on on healing yourself. Okay, mm -hmm. um, if you're, I know some of us are stubborn and we have to basically be on our deathbed as far as like when we have a cold or something you know to really go to the doctor um you know i'm one of them myself so i put myself in that category so i feel that if that's the situation you really need to stop being so stubborn and actually make your way to a doctor okay or maybe even if you're if you're going to depression you really need to really take take a step outside of your life and re look in you know um reevaluate your life you, right now is the time to to let go of the past and really look at life like it's a new life okay okay i just feel like i need to tell you that as of right now and i feel like there's someone on the other side right now that's really uh been trying to pound in the messages to you to make sure that you're doing what you need to be doing for yourself okay for the last month i have been dreaming of my uh, husband who passed away 21 years ago, May 23rd, and I find that weird. Is, it, is he trying to give me a message? Yeah, actually, I'll tell you right away, there's nothing weird about any any of that. Um, right away, when you do get some, a loved one in your in your life, as far as dreams, that is them um, basically visiting you and trying to tell you something, okay? <laughs> and, I, and that's probably what the message is from him, is that you okay. need to take care of yourself. Okay. Okay, honey. Thank you. You're welcome. Have a great day. Thank you, you too. Bye-bye. South Coast number one hit music station. 820 on your Friday morning. Free Fortune Friday. Mostly sunny. High of about 70 today. Some clouds and showers tonight and tomorrow. And then Mother's Day is going to be nice. It's going to clear up. And uh, you can take mom outside, maybe have a picnic with her in the park. Does that sound like a good idea? I can't say what I'm going to be doing for my mother. Oh, it's a, She's it's listening. A, well, we know what the conversation <laughs> will be at, at the end of the meal. So that's just what happens. Before. We discussed this earlier. Say no more. Um, but it's going to be a nice day. 59 at Fun 107. Espirito Gato is here. And uh, you got a shout out. Too? Yes, actually, today's my father-in-law's birthday, and I wanted to wish him a happy birthday. So, happy birthday, Richard. I'm not going to say how old you are. So. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, where, whereabouts are you out of? You know, you're based, you have a business, obviously. Where yeah, you um, well, I don't have a physical business of my own. Um, I do work at a couple of shops. Um, on Wednesdays, I'm at... Uh, Charisma Salon and Spa in Fairhaven. Oh, yeah, another place. Um, yeah, so while you're getting your hair did and your nails done, <laughs> you go in there and get a reading at the same time, and that's every Wednesday from 12 to 6. Okay. And then Thursdays and Fridays, the Sisters of Solace, which I'll be here uh, thereafter to, um, after this morning, mm -hmm. um, between 10 and uh, 5 p.m. And in five, so your charisma, and the other one was uh, Sisters of Solas. Sisters of Solas, you can yes. check that place out as well. Let's go back to the phones. Good morning, fun. One one zero seven. Good morning. Who's this? Michael. Michael, say hello to Espirito Gato. Good morning, Michael. How are you doing? Doing good. 
Good. I just, um, all right, so right away I picked up on your call, all right, while you were on hold. And the one thing that I do feel that I need to express to you as of right now, Michael, is um, right now you're either considering on possibly, uh, almost like you're reevaluating re a relationship, okay? And um, I feel like like you need to stick it through. Um, I am picking up on a miscommunication, or maybe even you guys are both hold, hold, withholding, holding back on as far as your feelings and and how what you really want out of life. Okay, um, I do see that. Um, you're a little bit more reserved about your emotions, and I feel that right now is the time for you to really, if you really care about this person in your life, um, you really need to open up to them and let them know exactly how you feel, okay? Just to make sure that you guys can connect, or maybe if you guys aren't connecting, to see if maybe there is a, a, a spark there between you two, okay? Um, sure. But I, I just see as of right now that you guys are still meant to be with each other. I don't see you guys um, separating or anything like that, okay? All right. <laughs> any other questions you any question you wanted to ask in specific? No, I started. Oh, so I, I feel like I hit it right on the nail, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it seems like there's no reason to care long anymore. I hear you. Hey, you know what? Sometimes I want to strangle my partner as well. That's part of yeah, being in listen, a relationship. Yeah, listen, I'm I'm fighting with my boyfriend too right now, and I want to wring his neck through a wall. <laughs> 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 no, it's like well, he, don't even talk anymore. Yeah, he, yeah. like, on, my boyfriend hates talking about anything that deals with, like, emotions. <laughs> you have to. You absolutely have to. If you love the person, you have to do it. Hey, thanks yeah. for the call, and good luck. It is 837. It's Neil White. Uh, Melissa's here, Espirito Gato, because it is Free Fortune Friday. We've got a caller on the line. Good morning, Fun 107. Good morning. How are good. you? I'm doing all right. How about yourself? Good. Say good morning to Espirito Gato. Hi, how are you doing? I'm doing good. How about you? Good. Thanks for asking. The sun is up and I'm happy. Um, <laughs> did you have any specific questions or did you want to go into a general reading? Um, more along the lines of what I really need to know um, within my given current situation. <laughs> Okay. I've been pulled in like a whole bunch of different directions and I don't know what to go. Okay, I hear you. So right now you're actually in a four-way stop. I usually say, I usually compare that to when you're driving and you end up stopping at a stop sign and you either have to make a left, right, or go straight. Okay, and as of right now, I got to tell you, there's there's a lot of a lot of reasons why you feel that you're in, in that position right now. I yeah. think that you. I'm picking up as of right now that you're so very unstable, that you're trying to sink your feet back into the floor, okay, which represents Earth, and, and, and you've been stressing yourself out. I see you a lot in your vehicle as well, almost like, like that's your sanctuary as of right now. Okay? It is. <laughs> um, well, what I, what I got to tell you, honey, is you really never stop looking, okay, because there's always, there's always ways that you can actually better your life temporarily until just to get you back on that right step that right road again okay mm -hmm. um and you see i really feel like i really got to tell you to come in for a reading because of the type of question you asked i feel that there's there's a lot of detail so and within two two minutes i can't really sum it all up for you but i do yeah. know for a fact that things are going to get better for you you just need you need to focus more. And if it. she wants to give you a call, how can she get in touch with you? Um, she can actually get in touch with me. You can find me through my website. Um, oh. It's uh, espiritogato.com. Or, um, or I'm at Sisters of Solace today, and you can actually contact the store there. I'm there till 5 o'clock. Okay. Cool. Okay, hon? But I feel like you do need a, a real deep uh, reading. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I probably do. Good luck. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. A Spirito Gato is here. He's been taking calls all, all morning long. We've got another person on the line. Hi, who's this? Hey, hi, I'm Amanda. Hi, Amanda. Good is morning, you, Amanda. Amanda, is your last name Hug and Kiss? Get no, it? it's not. Get it, Amanda <laughs> Hug and Kiss? <laughs> kidding, kidding. Uh, so, Amanda, did you have a specific question, or did you want me to go into general? Um, I'm looking for about my relationship. It's been kind of rocky, and I'm not sure if it's going to get fixed. I know it won't be fixed on its own, but... I don't know if I should move on or continue trying. Let me ask you, Amanda, did the gentleman that you're with right now, was he was he married before you, like being with you? No. No, he wasn't. Okay. Well, what I'm picking up here is the emotional baggage. That's why I figured I asked that question. I feel like there's emotional baggage, uh, almost like he's carrying a cross on his back right now. And, and usually that means emotional instability, okay? So okay. I, don't, I don't know, maybe he's a workaholic or maybe he's stressing out about work in general. But I he feel is like, a workaholic. <laughs> okay, so right, okay, then one of the things I am going to say, and I've learned this through life, okay, is work isn't 
work isn't um, everything in life, okay? No, we have to work to get things moving. But he has to kind of, he, he really has to consider, you know, having some happiness and some fun at the same time. It's not always about work. And then, obviously, by him doing that, that means you guys will be able to have more free time with each other, you know? Right. So he needs, to, he needs to definitely balance that, stop rocking that boat, okay? So okay. I think that's going more to, towards him, so I would speak up on, on your behalf. Okay. okay? <laughs> and then right, things okay. will get fixed. Things will get much better once he starts doing that. So a vacation, okay. a vacation is very, very soon. All right, good. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you, Amanda. Thank you. All right, bye bye. Bye bye. All right. So if folks want to get in touch with you again, they can. You're going to be. You have a few places that. Yeah, you're I know. I'm all over the place. <laughs> I'm a busy everywhere. Guy. What are you going to yeah, do? Yeah, and I can't complain. But no, actually, today um, I'm going to be at Sisters of Solace in Westport. Um, I'm there between 10 a.m. and 5 p.m. And it's right off of 177. So everybody come on by and visit me. It'd be nice to see you. And you also have a website? I do. It's um, www.espiritogato.com. And that is an easy way for people to uh, figure out where I'm at for the day. Right. It has your schedule up there as well. Yep. It's got uh, all my info. Well, we certainly thank you for stopping by today and making Free Fortune Friday oh. fabulous. <laughs> thank you. Thank you guys for, for having me here. And